Sandrita? Matteo? Did you make me a, did you make me a coffee, man? Would you like a coffee, chef? Fucking hell, what's the guy got to do, man? Anyone who think I've fucking owned the joint? In focus. I always knew that I was going to open my restaurant. I just didn't know when. I didn't wake up on my 26th birthday and go, oh, now it's right. I just, it just happened. And I just took the opportunity with both hands and, and never looked back. Food became serious when I started cooking and interacting with food on a different level. I started my career essentially properly with Tom Aikens when I was 16. And yeah, I learned on the job. I was never one for a classroom. I think, you know, my school years reflected that. I wasn't happy there. So I think that I found a new energy when I started cooking professionally. Yeah, I've worked with some amazing restaurateurs, you know, to leave Tom and, and then go on and work for Thomas Keller in America. And then find myself at Noma with Rene. So I feel lucky to have, have brushed shoulders with them. And then it was kind of, you know, I always wanted to, to carve out my own reputation and my own path. And that's what, led me to opening the restaurant. I think I underestimated the kind of media attention a 26-year-old boy from Nottingham would get opening a, a, a three million pound restaurant in London. The restaurant got a Michelin star after four months of opening, which is, you know, a huge achievement. What have you got for me for, for the house? For the house? Well, yeah. You and Phil, you never send me shit anymore. It's bullshit. Do you know what I mean? I don't know what you want for your house. Something nice, what you got? I think my management style is simple. I think it's that I try and get a collective of people to share a common goal. And that common goal is to make this restaurant the best restaurant it can be. No one is bigger than the restaurant, including myself. So I think that that's important. This is the, the actual boss in here. Linz, say hi. Hi. Scoob's from Worcester. <laughs> Worcester sauce. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It is Scoob. This is Ursula. Hi. This is the, the best guest relations entrepreneur in London. Would you say us? <laughs> yes, chef. It's true. Frank, say hi. Hello. This is Frank. Frank's one of the sous chefs here. He's been here. Frank's been here since uh, since the beginning. So what's that now, Frank? How long's that? He counts. He counts the days. <laughs> FG man. When I opened this restaurant, right? I just wanted to cook, you know, that's all it was. I just wanted to cook food. But then you realise very quickly, if you get, if you surround yourself with the right people, you, you know, the world's your oyster, really. I ain't a fucking innovator. I'm just a cook, man. I just cook the food.